Hello there, my name is Alma Faye and today we're playing Sally Face. You look kinda good today. It was just like last time, only this time it started in the hospital. I don't know what to expect, I didn't see anything about the game. What? Ew. Okay, okay, okay. Hello? It's okay, Sal. Everything is going to be okay now. Come and see. Who is this? What are you talking about? Where am I? Who is this? Sal, come and find me. Weird. Sounded like my dad. Oh. Okay. Okay. Um, hospital bed? This is me? What is going on? Why don't I have a fa- Push? Did that- What? Looks like something's there, but it's too dark to see. What? Can I- Yeah. A golden retriever! There's a key. A key! D C B A Uh, what's A? Is there an order? How am I supposed to know? A, B, C, D Dun dun Okay, it's D, I guess D, M, D, N, D, O D O Oh my god, why is the ground like that? Why are the walls like this? What? I'm very confused. What is going on? Dog. Dog. Dof. Doe. Do. That's something that exists. Okay, it was not. D. O. Do. <laughs> dog. Okay, it was dog. Okay, now we're outside and there's a funeral happening just outside the hospital. Can I even see? Uh, speak. Who's a good doggy? Who's a good boy? I buried her alive, kid. You tell me. Huh? Go see for yourself. Diane Fisher, mother and wife. Climb down. Damn, this is a too emo for me. You know? Wait, wait. Battery's not included. I need a code, obviously. There's. Okay. It's locked. Passcode. Uh huh. Oh, I fucking broke it. Wait. Ah, it didn't matter. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Okay, let's let's try to reflect about what's going on. So we woke up with a bloody face in a hospital bed. Someone said, come find me. And I said, she said, looks like my dad. Then there was a funeral and a dog that was speaking. And there was... Oh, here's my dad. Okay, talk. Dad? You're not my son. My son's not a murderer. Son? Is it, I'm... I'm not a girl. This... Your fault. This your fault. Who died? Hello? Oh no, why is it so silent? Hello? Okay, jump scare, jump scare, jump scare. Mom? Are you... And that's when I woke up. Oh, it was a dream! 
Mm, yes, it's an interesting dream. I think we should come back to that dream later, but for now, can you tell me more about the body? Which one? The second one, the one from the apartment. Dad and I had just moved in. I had a weird feeling about the place right away. Episode 1. Strange Neighbors. Ooh, spooky, spooky! <laughs> this will be our new beginning. We can finally leave what happened in New Jersey behind us now. Why don't you go explore the building and make some friends while I finish unpacking? Why do I have a mask? Why do I have a mask? Oh, no. I, I'm not gonna speak in first person. That's sleep aid. Living sleep aid. Dad still has trouble sleeping at night after. After? But, okay, mommy's probably dead. For real. What happened in New Jersey? That's my question. Bags. Just some stuff dad got from the store. Nothing important. Leave. Sales room. Gizmo! I see you've made yourself at home already, Gizmo. Must be nice. Oh my god, what a big kid! Nico! Okay, let him be. He's sleeping. Gear boy. <laughs> I was wondering where that was. Okay, now we have the gear boy. Let's go to dad's room. Hey, kiddo. Decided to take a break from unpacking? That's not a bad idea. We've been at it for a while now. Maybe I'll take a break myself. What do you think about this place? I miss Jersey. I miss mom. See you. What do you think about this place? It may not be as nice as our old house, but we'll make the best of things. As long as we have each other, I think we can make a real home here. Try not to get into too much trouble. Okay, dad. Okay, let's explore the apartment complex. And see why the neighbors are so suspicious. 402. 401. Knock. I'm not just gonna knock in my... I mean, I might. Oh. <gasps> oh no. Hello. Why are you standing here? I'm protecting nosy little freaks like you from seeing what they ought not not to see ought ought I don't know how to pronounce that. Now scram, I don't get paid to babysit. Jesus, what happened in that room? Police business, kid. Why don't you run along back to your parents? I wish I could. What was that, a wise ass? Oh my god, nothing. Oh my god, that's what I thought. Stupid weird kid. <laughs> what the fuck? Damn, that's a mean cop. No one's home. Okay. L look at my legs. They're, they're so skinny. Okay, let's. Oh. Okay, let's go to floor five. Why not? This floor is currently being renovated. For your safety, please make your way to the nearest exit. Maybe I should not have come here. Open. Oh no, I don't think this is a good idea. Ooh, no, 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 no. Okay, let's start at 504. Hello? Ah, why? Sorry, I didn't think anyone lived up here. Why is there a, a homeless man? Hello, sir, are you okay? Leave him, leave him. You shouldn't have come here. I probably shouldn't. I'm sorry, I was just trying to get to know my new neighbors and... A dark place. This building. Horrible things happen. Are you sure you're okay? Oh no. What the? He's a ghost. Oh no, leave. Bathroom. There's hands. I'm actually curious. I'm gonna explore. That's weird. The bat but the bathroom door is locked. Okay. Maybe I should go. No, no. I'm gonna explore. Okay, this one is locked. Okay. 
Locked. Locked. Okay, okay. Let's go down. Let's go down. Let's go down. Let's. Ha it's haunted. Okay, the place is haunted. Okay. Floor three. We need a key card to go to the. I was gonna say the cave, <laughs> the garage or something. Oh, hello, ma'am. You're kind of cute. <laughs> no one's home. Wait, I can't talk to her. Why? Oh, I can. Hey. Oh my. Sorry, you just startled me a little bit. You must be one of the new guys from 402, yeah? Yeah, it's just me and my dad. My name's Sal. Pleasure to meet you, Sal. I'm Lisa. I take care of this place, keep things up and running. So if you ever need help with anything, don't hesitate to ask, okay? Sure, thanks. She sounds friendly, but I think that's suspicious, honestly. Okay, floor two. Okay. 203. No one's home. No one's home! 204. Yeah? Who's there? Hello, I'm new in the building. Just wanted to introduce myself to the neighbors. Okay, come in. Don't... Ew, that's kind of weird. That... <gasps> Hi, my name is Cell. I just moved in today with my dad. What the hell is with your face, child? Oh, I know. Young teens, a new generation of self-expression. I was young once myself, I get it. Just so long as you're not in a gang or anything, you're not in a gang, are you? No, no, it's nothing like that. Wonderful. Well, I'm Charlie. Don't mess with my stuff and we'll be okay. I'm a collector, you see? I collect many things. Yeah, I can see that. These things are like my family. So if you mess with my collections, you're messing with my family, got it? Yes, sir, not a problem. I won't be giving you an... Good to hear. Um... Okay. I don't think it's safe to be close to this man. Look, can I look? I'm just looking. Bask in the glory of my complete set of glitter ponies. My little pony. A great accomplishment it is <laughs> to have this full set. You can look all you want, but don't even think about touching them. What's a glitter, what's a glitter pony? Sal, run, run away. Sal? My god, child, have you never seen my glitter, glitter ponies? Rainbow Spectacular! It's only the greatest television show ever produced. It's got drama, action, romance, comedy, everything you could want. And the ponies, oh, the ponies, don't even get me started, mm, yeah. Um, I guess I missed that one, I'll have to look for it on TV. Yes, you will, trust me, you won't regret it. Let's... Leave. Let's just leave. Don't ever speak to this man again. He looks like... Mm-hmm. 202. No one's home. 201. Mm, I guess no one's home. What? Okay. One of Addison. Oh dear. What a frightful... Uh, pardon me. Let's start over. Hello, young sir, new resident of Edison Apartments, room 402. How may I be of service? How do you know who I am? Can I come in? No. How do you know who I am? I know all that takes place within these walls, sir. You'll do good to remember that. Can I come in? No, I don't want to come in. Goodbye. Farewell, friend. No one's home. Okay. 102. 101. Oh? Yeah, what do you want? A little early for trick or treating, isn't it? Ugh. Stupid good for nothing kids. <laughs> she looked like a witch. Should I ask this man to come in? Sure, let's let's ask him. Hello, young sir. Yes, yes. Can I come in? Heavens no, I'm afraid that I'm quite particular about my privacy. I'm sure you understand. Yeah, sure. Sure. Sure, I understand. Goodbye. Okay. Uh, I guess we can't go to the last floor, right? No, we can't. I'm gonna ask the lady if I can have the card, I guess. If I can. What was her name? I don't know. Um, talk. Lisa. Hey, Lisa. Hey, Sal, what's up? How long have you been working here? Yeah, yeah. 
Actually, I don't just work here. I live here too. I'm on call 24-7 for any urgent main ma maintenances needed. Needs. <laughs> so do you know anything about what happened in 403? Yes. It's a shame you and your dad had this crummy first impression. I promise things aren't typically so gruesome around here. Poor Mrs. Sanderson. She was murdered. Is there anything fun to s uh, You know what? I have a son around your age. I think you two would get along great. He's downstairs in our apartment. You should go introduce yourself. Sure, I'll go say hi. Great, his name is Larry. He'll be in the basement. Tell him I sent you down. Oh? You'll need a keycard to access it from the elevator though. Here, take this one. I've got a few extras. Cool, thanks. Oh, okay. Is this building haunted? Cell, sweetie. I've been taking care of the Addison apartments for a long time and I've never seen any ghosts or goblins. The basement. Okay. 1B. I just entered the place. I didn't even knock. I just entered the place. Okay. Oh, it's the same as mine. What the hell was that? Good question, really. Larry's room. Yeah? Hey, uh, Larry, your mom said I should come say hi. I just moved into 402. Oh, hey, come on in. Door's open. Oh my god, he's an artist! Odin's blood, zombie, everything all the time. The fear within destroyed your steel. You, your soul will be destroyed. That things. Whoa, nice mask. Why do I wear a mask? It's a prosthetic. Oh shit. Sorry, man. It's cool. I'm used to much worse by now. So I'm glad you like it. So, do you like have no face under there? What happened? I'd rather not talk about that, bro. Okay, change of subject. I'm Larry. I live down here with my mom. I'm Sal. My friends call me Sally Face. I just moved here with my dad from New Jersey. Sally Face? I guess I didn't really have any decent friends, to be honest. You're pretty strange. I like you. We're gonna get along great. Ha, that's what your mom said to you. <laughs> Mother knows best. I like your shirt. Thanks, it stands for... Sally Faith. <laughs> I do have my own clothing line, so... Haha, <laughs> it's actually from this metal band called Sanity's Fall. Do you like metal? I don't know. Oh, that's gotta change. Check out this song. It's their first single. The full album comes out in a few months. What happened in 402? Oh, he's gonna tell me. Shh, not so loud, man. What? What is it? The killer is still in the building. How do you know that? I saw it happen. Are you high right now? I wish I was, man. This was some scary shit. You know who did it? Yeah, it was definitely Charlie. Big creeper from 204. He was wearing gloves, so I don't think they got any prints or anything. What happened? Okay, so, I was helping Mrs. Sanderson. Oh my god, turn off the music! I was helping Mrs. Sanderson with a clogged toilet. I was just finished up when I heard him burst in, yelling like a lunatic. I know what you've done! Herman told me everything, you stupid bitch! She tried to calm him down, but before she could... Get even a few words out, he was cutting her throat wide open. I was shocked, I couldn't move, I was frozen by fear, man. Anyways, it all happened so fast and then he cleaned up quickly and left. I don't know how, but he didn't even see me. I haven't really told anyone yet, not even my own mom, but I trust you. You just met me, dude. Shouldn't you tell the cops? I actually tried to talk to that detective, but he won't listen to me without some kind of evidence. Like my word isn't enough, ugh. 
What's up with the guy in 103? Yeah, good question. That's Mr. Addison. He owns this place. I don't think I've ever seen him leave his room. Always talks through his little mail slot. He's a nice dude, just real strange. Oh yeah, if you say Addison tea, please and thank you to him, he'll give you a cup of his famous tea. I hate the stuff myself, but the adults seem to love it. Okay, you're a cool dude. Radio. That's a... Uh, it's a police scanner. I can listen in on local cop chatter. How the hell did you get this thing? That's a story for another day, but hey, you just gave me a great idea. If I make a fake call, maybe I can distract them long enough for you to sneak into 403. Bruh. Maybe we can find some kind of evidence to show that detective. So what's the plan? I'll call in a bank robbery hostage, hostage situation and that should clear out the cops for sure. We can use my walkie talkies to communicate during the whole thing. Then I can give you a heads up too, once I know the cops are coming back. Sounds pretty solid to me. <laughs> Maybe just switch the bank robbery with armed robbery at a, at like a gas station or drugstore. Make it a little more believable. Mm, yeah, I guess you're right. Good call, Sally. Here, take this. Head to your room and let me know when you're ready. Just press that shift button there to call me. Oh my god. Ah. Use walkie-talkie. Okay. Look at this. Oh my god. I like your paintings. Thanks, dude. It's my passion. <laughs> it's his passion. Okay, let's go home. And break in, eh? A murder scene, why not? Uh, shift? Okay, I'm in my room now. Alright, let's do this. I'm gonna make the call. Give me a sec. Okay, it's done. I heard a bunch of hustling upstairs, so I think it worked. Go see if you can get into 403 now. Okay? I'm gonna... I'm gonna get arrested. But okay. Hello? Oh. Examine. There's a broken coffee table with some books. Look like anything important? Just looks like junk to me. Alright, keep looking then. There's gotta be something else. Man, this is pretty twisted. Tell me about it. My little pony. There's these little figures. Looks like one is missing. I can see a small clearing in the blood. That's it. I know how we can get him. Get out of there and come down to the basement. Okay. Sanderson and Charlie both collected those weird toys. Mrs. Sanderson got this super rare one or something. She was telling me about it that day I was fixing her toilet. I wouldn't be surprised if that's why he oofed her. <laughs> That dude always did give me the creeps. Just something unsettling about him, you know? Yeah. Yeah, I know. Wow, that's crazy. This guy definitely needs to get caught. We can't live in the building with a murderer. Exactly. That's why you gotta get into Charlie's room and see if you can find that toy. Wait, why do I have to do it? Charlie isn't too fond of me. There's no way he'd let me in. He accused me of stealing snacks from his room. Snacks, fucking fatty. Alright, alright, I'll do it. Won't be able to sleep at night otherwise. Cool, you're the man, Sally. Here, take this baggie. You can slip the toy in without touching it. Why do I get the feeling you've done this before? Haha, <laughs> nah, man. I just watch too much tel television. Okay, uh... How do I... I know they're so... Okay, we, we've we had this conversation. Can I... Nice place you got. Do you leave here alone? I can't say anything different. What? Can I do something else? No. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go to Mr. Addison and ask him for the tea. Hello, young sir. New resident of Addison apartment. Addison tea, please and thank you. Yes, coming right up. Can he fit a cup through... Okay. There you are, sir. Please enjoy. Oh, thank you. Okay, so... What am I supposed... Wait. I have sleeping pills in my room. In my apartment. In the bathroom. Uh, do I drug the man? Is that what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna drug the man. Sleeping aid. 
This will knock that fat bastard out for sure. <gasps> okay, okay. What does it say? Tea and sleep aid. A gift tea to Charlie. Okay, okay, okay. I, I have a present for you, my friend. Oh, there's no option. <gasps> Ooh, is that Edison tea I smell? Yeah, I just got some from... Oh, I just love Edison tea. Give it here. Ah, so tasty, so relaxing. Okay, 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 okay. <gasps> I got it. Got the toy. Score. Let's go, let's go before he wakes up. No, what's my objective? Give evidence to the detective. I'm just, I'm just gonna go to the detective and say... That's not a detective, that was just a policeman. Am I just gonna go to him and say, Oh, look, here's some evidence. Yes, there's blood on it. Okay. Talk. How's it going, officer? Any news on finding the killer? If I find out you're tampering with police evidence, well, you better pray I don't find out. I think I found something. What the hell are you talking about, kid? Well, I got this. Look, I'm busy here. If you got something important, go share it with the detective down on the first floor. Okay, the first floor. There was no one in the first floor. Maybe he's there now, okay. Hello, detective? Where's the detective? The detective? I don't see a detective. No one's home. But this is the first floor. Is the detective there? No. No one's home. Wait. Is it easy in the witch house? In the witch's house? Nah. You again? Why do you kids insist on making my life miserable? Please just leave me alone. <laughs> when will this torture end? <laughs> Oh! Oh, the corridor... Talk. What's going on? Hello, young man. You just moved in today, correct? Yes, sir. I already spoke with your father. Seems you two were out of state when everything happened last night. Story checks out. That's good. Try not to get in our way from now on, okay? We're investigating a serious crime. Uh, was it murder? <laughs> was it murder? I can't talk about that. I think I know who did it. Bruh. Have you been talking with that Larry boy? I can't put much faith into a teenager with a criminal record. Oh, I, um... Look, I appreciate you kids trying to help. I do. But unless you've got some sort of evidence, then please refrain from spreading rumors. I've got evidence. Let me see that. This comes from Charlie's room. How did you get this? I was just saying hello to my new neighbors, you know, trying to introduce myself to everyone. I was in there talking to Charlie and he was showing me all of his toys. That's when I noticed one had blood on it. I thought for sure this would be helpful, so I grabbed it with my lunch bag. Well, well, a little detective in training, huh? Just remember next time, you come to us with this info instead of putting yourself at risk, okay? Yes, sir, you got it. It probably wasn't him. It's too obvious, right? It's too obvious. Oh. Oh, this keeps going. Oh, I did not know that. Edison Apartments. <gasps> What's this? Leave. Wait, wait, wait. Are there more up? Leave. Can I? Oh. What's going on? Why is the detective here now? <gasps> oh! Oh my god. Wait. Good work today, Sal. You can rest easy now. What? I'm innocent, I swear. I thought you were my friend. Um... What? Look. No one was around, so I looked into the back window of the van. Such a horrific sight for anyone to see, let alone a young child as you were. Oh, he doesn't have the mask. Fifteen years old and already you had witnessed two gruesome scenes. It must have been very traumatic for you. Sure, I guess so. And all these years later, the new evidence that finally proved Charlie was falsely accused. After so much of his life spent behind bars, how did that make you feel? 
I'm not convinced it wasn't him. Yes, so you've said. Like I've said, the guy was my best friend all through high school. And after high school? We've been over this. I lost touch with Larry after graduation. I don't know where he is now. You seem to be upset by my mention of him. I just don't know what good asking the same question all the time is doing. I thought you were supposed to help me. Yes, bitch. I understand your frustration, Sal. I do. I want to help you, but you seem to be holding something back. I can't help you unless you're completely honest with me. Do you understand where I'm coming from? Yeah. Well, unfortunately, our time is up for today. That will be $80. Wait, I... It's about Larry. I'm sorry, Cell. You know how strict they are with the schedule. Please keep that thought for our next session. <sighs> next week will be our last meeting before your trial, so I hope you let me help you. <gasps> Wait, am I in jail? <gasps> I don't think you're a murderer, Sal. You might be the only one. Yo. Sal? Sally, where are you? Love you more than those bitches before say you remember, oh baby. So that's how it ends. Episode one. Do you guys think I should play the rest? Let me know. That's going to be it for the video. If you enjoy that. Subscribe, like, comment, share, and I'll see you next time for another horror game.